The discovery of Proxima b in 2016 has captivated the minds of many scientists and space enthusiasts alike. Recently, the James Webb Space Telescope, the most advanced telescope in the world, was directed to observe this mysterious exoplanet, resulting in the clearest image of Proxima b ever captured. This breakthrough has left many wondering what secrets this image may hold. Could this distant planet potentially support life? The possibilities are both thrilling and endless. Join us as we explore the clearest picture of Proxima b that was just released by the James Webb Space Telescope. For a long time, people have been curious about the universe, and as technology has improved, it's only natural that humans would want to learn more about it. To explore time and space, we sent the James Webb Space Telescope into space specifically to check out Proxima b. The James Webb Space Telescope is currently the most advanced one up there, it can see really far and is way better than the Hubble Space Telescope. This telescope helps astronomers study the early universe and figure out how galaxies, stars, and planets were born. Scientists can analyze the colors and the pictures it takes by using its camera and filters to focus on certain light colors. The telescope is also going to check out Proxima b and see if there are any signs of aliens. NASA, the European Space Agency, and the Canadian Space Agency work together to build this telescope, but NASA's Goddard Space Flight Center is in charge of it and the Space Telescope Science Institute runs its day-to-day -day operations. The JWST has a big mirror made up of 18 foldable hexagonal pieces covered in gold. It's way larger than the Hubble telescope's mirror, collecting more light and being super strong at observing different types of light, especially in the infrared range. To work well, this telescope needs to be really cold, below minus 223 degrees Celsius, so it doesn't mess up the infrared light it's trying to collect. They started thinking about this telescope in 1996, but it went through a lot of changes. After a big redesign in 2005, they finished building it in 2016. It's a $10 billion masterpiece named after James E. Webb, who was in charge of NASA in the 1960s. It was launched on December 25, 2021, from French Guiana. By January 2022, it was in its spot in space about 1.5 million kilometers away from Earth. The first picture it took was shown to the public on July 11, 2022. The images it captures in infrared are like nothing we've seen before. The picture of Proxima b showed that the planet gets about 1,000 times more solar wind radiation than Earth, which makes it less likely for there to be life there because of the powerful flares. Proxima Centauri, a small red dwarf star, was already under investigation for planets before they found Proxima Centauri b. Early studies in 2008 and 2009 said there probably weren't big planets in the area where a planet could support life. This was interesting because usually small stars like red dwarfs have planets in that good for life zone. Then, in 2013, astronomers saw faint signs that the star was moving a bit, suggesting there might be a planet. After looking for it for years, in January 2016, they started a project called Pale Red to double check if there really was a planet close to Proxima Centauri. In August 2016, scientists said they found Proxima Centauri b in the right zone for life around Proxima Centauri. They later named this mysterious planet Proxima b finding it was a big deal because it orbits the nearest star system to our solar system, called Alpha Centauri, which is about 4.2 light-years away. This means that when we look at it from Earth, we're seeing how it was 4.2 years ago. In 2020, scientists guessed that Proxima Centauri b is about the same weight as Earth, but they're not exactly sure. They also aren't sure how big it is. It could be between 0.94 and 1.4 times the size of Earth. Depending on what it's made of, it might have a big core like Mercury or lots of water. We don't know how far the planet is from its star or how long it takes to go around it. Scientists use computer simulations to make educated guesses about the planet, but these are based on assumptions about things like the environment around it, heat from certain processes, how it spins, and the star's radiation. Proxima Centauri b probably formed under different conditions than Earth. It has less water and likely experienced more intense impacts because it's close to Proxima Centauri. Because of the powerful flares, Proxima Centauri, a small red dwarf star, was already under investigation for planets before scientists discovered Proxima Centauri b. Early studies in 2008 and 2009 suggested there likely weren't any large planets in the habitable zone, the region where a planet could support life. 
This was intriguing because red dwarfs, like Proxima Centauri, typically have planets in this life-friendly zone. Then, in 2013, astronomers observed faint movements in the star, hinting at the possibility of a planet nearby. After years of careful searching, a project called Pale Red was launched in January 2016 to confirm the existence of this planet. By August 2016, scientists announced they had indeed found Proxima Centauri b, located in the habitable zone around the star. This was a significant discovery because Proxima Centauri b orbits the closest star system to our solar system, Alpha Centauri, only about 4.2 light years away. When we observe it from Earth, we're essentially looking back in time, seeing how the planet appeared 4.2 years ago. In 2020, researchers estimated that Proxima Centauri b might be about the same mass as Earth, but they're not entirely sure about its exact size. Estimates place it between 0.94 and 1.4 times the size of Earth. Depending on its composition, it could have a large core like Mercury or be abundant in water. Scientists aren't yet certain how far the planet is from its star or how long it takes to complete an orbit. They rely on computer models to make educated guesses based on factors like the planet's surrounding environment, heat from its processes, and radiation from the star. It's likely that Proxima Centauri be formed under conditions quite different from Earth, with less water and more intense impacts due to its close proximity to Proxima Centauri.